lesson, I will be talking about HTML, which is a programming language, especially for web design. Question, how are web pages made? Think about it. While you're thinking, uh, I wanna start uh, with introduction of HTML. HTML is the language for uh, building web page. Why HTML? HTML lets us build our own web page. Web pages allow us to easily share our ideas and creations with the world. Facebook, Google, Code HS, every page on the internet. All built with HTML by people who learned HTML. Why HTML? Your, your web page seems like on the left that any browser on any device and you can create a beautiful page quick explanation of a browser for those who don't know that term application on your computer that knows how to interpret these html documents and display them as the visual audible web page you see on the internet including this video today we are going to learn how to make this part which is left side so html hyper Text, markup, and what's the last thing? Can you guess? Which is language. So hypertext, text displayed on a computer that has links to the other hypertext documents, which is hyperlinks. So, and you see, this is hypertext. Next one is markup language. So you annotate text to define how it should be displayed. So, how does HTML markup the text of a web page? HTML tags mark up the text of a document in order to tell the browser how the text should be displayed. HTML is made up of tags that mark up of the text of in a document in order to tell the browser how the text should be displayed. HTML is just normal text plus mark up tags. Enclose in an angle brackets, which is headline one here, and this is the angle brackets. Not displayed on the resulting web page. Inform the browser about how certain text should be displayed. Our first HTML tag, H1, text start and end with an angle. The name of the tag goes in between the anchor brackets. Mm -hmm. 
open tag, close tag. If we're gonna create a web page, which is gonna be your tag, you have to have tag open like this, which is H1, and you're gonna close, you have to have slashes before hello. Note the slash on the closing tag. And content affected by the tag, hello. Let's see this in the editor. Hi, I would like to introduce a practice about uh, hyperlink and some of the websites we can include in HTML. So I'm going to use the format that I, that PhS is using, but I'm gonna show you how to change the links and create your own web page. So here it says welcome to CodeHS. I'm gonna say welcome to Mr. Oz computer class. And I'm gonna put here, it says about CodeHS, I'm gonna say about HTML. And I'll put a link for example, Wikipedia, I can use it. I had it ready. Uh, I'm gonna put it here. And then for this one, yeah, we already have Wikipedia, but I'm gonna have something else here. I'm gonna use W3School, which is a really good website that I'm using now uh, for any programming language. I'm gonna make this a let's say uh, editor like try editor which is I'm gonna include a, a link when you try how to use HTML when we click on this link it will go to that website so as we have here I'm gonna come here you see, this is the try yourself. I'm gonna click on it. I'll copy, cut it, and then I'm gonna add on my website, which is here by replacing with Wikipedia. So it should work now. Okay, so uh, when I run, so as you see, it says, welcome to Mr. Oz computer class. Now about HTML, when I click on it, it's gonna go on uh, Wikipedia. Okay, when I'm gonna try, it says try editor. Uh, I'm gonna, I need to, by the way, run it again, because it's just demo. I need to say try editor. When I click on it, I'll have the editor page, which I can play with. And now your turn, you can go on this w3schools.com uh, editor it's so common uh, you can just play with the tools and create your own page and thank you and have a wonderful week